Our brains are shaping our decisions long before we become consciously aware of them. That's the conclusion of a remarkable new study which shows that patterns of activity in certain parts of our brain can predict the outcome of a decision seconds before we're even aware that we're making one. The famed psychoanalyst Sigmund Freud believed that behavior and personality were derived from the constant and unique interaction of conflicting psychological forces that operate at three different levels of awareness. Freud delineated the mind in distinct levels, each with their own roles and functions. The three levels of the Mindare, it consists of anything that could potentially be brought into the conscious mind. Conscious mind contains all of the thoughts, memories, feelings, and wishes of which we are aware at any given moment. The unconscious mind is a reservoir of feelings, thoughts, urges, and memories that are outside of our conscious awareness. The unconscious contains contents that are unacceptable or unpleasant, such as feelings of pain, anxiety, or conflict. An example of the unconscious mind can be seen in what are known as slips of the tongue. Many of us have experienced what is commonly referred to as a Freudian slip at some point or another. These misstatements are believed to reveal underlying unconscious thoughts or feelings. Now, let's talk a little about the subconscious mind and know some of its surprising facts. The subconscious mind doesn't sleep, rest, or take breaks at any time, all through your life. It has something or other important work to do throughout the day and night. The subconscious mind controls your heartbeat, blood circulation, regulates digestion and elimination of wastes from the body and even during your sleep it manages all your bodily activities. It has been found that 95% of our brain activity is unconscious. That means that the decisions that you are making or the actions that you are taking all lie beyond your consciousness. Forming a habit is natural. But do you know the reason behind forming habits? It is the subconscious mind that does these activities without us realizing it. Live in the moment is a statement by which the subconscious mind has sworn by. So the thoughts of the future or the nostalgia of the past are the work of your conscious mind, whereas the subconscious mind pulls you back to reality. The subconscious mind never takes a break, and it listens to you all the time. The subconscious is the part of our minds that makes decisions without our needing to actively think about them. It's different from the conscious mind, which encompasses the thoughts we know we are having at any given moment. It's also different from the unconscious mind which holds past events and experiences that we don't remember at all. But our subconscious minds can also work against us. So many of us end up turning our frustration and upset against ourselves, sabotaging any potential success. We start thinking that we deserve better, and we may work a little harder for a few days. But rather than take action and strive for lasting change, we drop right back down to where we think we belong. In our careers, our finances, our relationships, our health, our general sense of well-being. While the information in the unconscious mind is outside of awareness, it continues to have an influence on a person's behavior. Some of the ways the unconscious can affect behavior include negative thoughts, self-defeating thoughts and behaviors, feelings of anger, compulsive behaviors, childhood behavioral problems, difficulties in interpersonal relationships, distressing patterns in romantic relationships, attitudes about others, unhealthy habits, distressing dreams, first impressions of other people, prejudice and stereotypes. Now that you're in a powerful, determined state, it's time to adopt positive habits that will reprogram your mind to have total certainty in itself. One potent strategy for shaping your subconscious is through the meticulous establishment of clear, well-defined objectives. Think of it as encoding your mind with a blueprint for success. Suppose you aspire to bolster your self-confidence. In that case, you must articulate your ambitions clearly. Positive affirmations stand as a formidable tool for rewiring the subconscious. The consistent repetition of affirmative statements, like, I am confident, can elevate self-esteem. Intriguingly, research suggests that the use of affirmations can yield a substantial increase in overall well-being. 
Visualization of your goals serves to establish a profound connection with your subconscious. In this process, you vividly imagine yourself achieving your aspirations, akin to a mental rehearsal. Negative influences can obstruct your path to success. Hence, it's crucial to exercise mindfulness in selecting your surroundings, whether in terms of people or media. Research has uncovered the potentially detrimental impact of social media on self-esteem. While the subconscious mind can serve as a wellspring of motivation, the linchpin of success lies in the execution of deliberate actions. Without tangible steps, your goals may remain mere dreams. Hence, it is imperative to craft a well-structured plan and act on it. Reprogramming your subconscious mind is a journey that demands time and patience. Along the way, you may encounter resistance, which is a natural facet of the process. Maintaining unwavering patience and persistence in your efforts will ultimately yield positive changes. Subconscious mind programming can be tricky. By its very definition, you can't always tell what it's thinking. But there are ways to tell if your efforts to reprogram your mind are working. You're becoming more self-aware. You must be aware of your subconscious mind in order to reprogram it. Are you getting better at stopping negative self-talk and controlling your emotions? Are you able to shift your focus at will? These are signs of self-awareness. You take more risks. Everyone has different risk tolerances, but limiting beliefs cause us not to take any risks at all. When you reprogram your mind, you'll increase your confidence and be ready to get out of your comfort zone. You attract positivity. Whatever you consistently think about and focus upon, you move toward. That's the law of attraction. Programming your mind to think more positively can actually bring more positive things into your life. Your subconscious mind stands as a potent ally in your quest for personal growth and success. Always remember, patience and persistence are the twin keys to unlocking the profound power of your subconscious mind. Thank you for accompanying us on this enlightening journey. Don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell for more informative content.